hello and welcome to my channel please like share and subscribe if you like this video and thank you so much for watching thank you thank you thank you to my day ones twos and threes thank you to all my new subscribers that's coming in that means well thank you all so very much i appreciate you all and welcome 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 this video is for entertainment and educational purposes only so everything is alleged some is not and the fair act use is in my description box y'all so let's get to it. Let's get to it. So remember when I was talking to you all and I was telling you all about, you know, there's something to brewing in the industry right now. And y'all always know that they're lining up the next person. Okay. Um, so, you know, recently a little something, something else just popped up. Okay, y'all. So everybody know about the beef between... NBA young boy and Lil Dirt. They do not get along at all. And it's partial the reason because of King Von and all this other stuff, okay? And them, you know, rapping against each other and beeping beefing and everything like that. Okay, y'all. So these two right here do not get along at all. Okay. And I, for the people that keeps up with Young Boy NBA, they already know that he pretty much stays to himself in the industry. He don't really he don't really vibe with people like that. Okay, he kind of is like a loner. I think that's why I'm kind of drawn to him because he kind of stays to himself. He don't really be bothered with a lot of people because he don't trust everybody. Okay? And um, that's a good thing to do right now because you don't know who to trust in the industry because everybody is snakes out here. Okay? Even though, you know, you might think you can hang out with this person because oh we in the same street associate but different street associates is coming together to take out other people even in their same street association okay y'all so i just want y'all to you know you know keep up with what's going on with this situation too now nba young boy um he said that um he wouldn't do any music or you know be socialized with Lil Uzi at all because you know he was feeling like Rich the Kid was his homie okay so out of respect for Rich the Kid NBA he met he let it be known that he would not do you know socialize with Lil Uzi okay y'all so for the people that don't know who they are um this is Rich the Kid and Lil Uzi because they have a beef they beefing all right they don't like each other so, due to the fact that NBA young boy, he kind of socializes a little, little bit with um, Rich the Kid. Like I said, out of respect for him, he said that he would not deal with, you know, have nothing to do with Lil Uzi. Okay? Now, just because you're loyal to somebody does not make them loyal to you. Okay, y'all? And this is why I say all the time, you got to keep your circle small. Because this could happen in any situation if you have a family member that you do not get along with at all and you got another family member that you're close to if that family member that you close to hang out with the one that you're not it's always going to be some bull it's always going to be some stuff started something said something stuff. and i just i couldn't be able to trust the person that i'm close to if you hang out with somebody that don't like me you see what i'm saying y'all and it's the same thing with this friendship and the industry and all of this other stuff, too. How can you trust somebody that hang out with your ops? You cannot. Okay? You cannot. And just because NBA Youngboy is, you know, seem like a loyal person when it comes to friends and somebody that's close to him, he feels like he should get the same treatment, but it doesn't always work like that. Okay, y'all? So, <sighs> little Rich... You know, Rich the Kid, he don't feel the same way about Young Boy NBA as Young Boy NBA feel about him or NBA Young Boy. Okay, y'all, here you go, because I know y'all gonna try to correct me. He don't feel the same way that he feel, and he feel like you know, if that's what you want to do, that's on you. But I'm not gonna do that. So recently, you know, Rich the Kid, he was hanging out with Lil Dirt, y'all. Okay. He hanging out with Lil Dirt. And not only is hanging out with him, he breaking bread at the table, kicking it with him. And to be honest with you, um, when you look at this picture, you know, he looked like he trying to be slick. 
that he hanging out with little dirt and he know that little dirt and young NBA young boy don't even get along and he know that you know NBA young boy got a little you know um soft spot for him as far as a friendship because he tried to be loyal to him by not having nothing to do with little Uzi Vert okay but he's not getting that same treatment y'all okay and this is one of the reasons why I think that you know NBA young boy is um a little sick of the industry because everybody's so fake. Everybody is so fake all the time. Okay? And I want y'all to pay attention to Lil Dirt. He be all over the place. With different people in their ops and this and that and that and this. He's all over the place. With everybody. And I told y'all, it's something a-brewing. It's something weird going on in the industry because it's a lot of, you know, backdooring going on. A lot of, you know, stuff going on. Lately, a lot more than usual, that people are hanging out with people that, you know, they don't normally hang out with. They're hanging out with people that, you know, the people that they usually hang out with don't mess with. This is what's going on right now. That's why I told you, it's something weird in the air going on. And like I told y'all, you know, some people was telling me about the 5th, that there was some kind of portal supposed to be opening and this and that. And remember, I was telling y'all that something was being ushered in um this month because it started last month but this month especially with this new album coming out with beyonce and all this other weird stuff going on okay y'all it's a lot of stuff going on even last month month before then with the red moon it's a lot of stuff going on this year that's odd and it's something big big a brewing okay y'all it's something really big brewing and this is why i was telling people that um you got to pay attention to the videos because usually when somebody's about to be taken out, everybody wants to do some music with them so that they can come up after they're taken out. Then their music going to be streaming like crazy. That's what I was telling y'all. And like I said, a lot of backdooring is going on right now. Is Rich the Kid um, a, a, a fence rider? It looks like it. It looks like he's a fence rider, y'all. He wants to be with this person one minute, that person one minute, and these people do not get along. And even though they have, you know, a little loyalty to him, he's not, he don't have loyalty to them, okay? Should NBA young boy, you know, back away from Rich the Kid? I think so. I really do. I think he should not even be dealing with this guy. And I know a lot of people going to be like, oh, this, it's the industry, just how they make their money. But this is also how they set each other up to y'all, Okay. And like I said, when these videos start popping out, you got to look at the last year of videos and who they doing videos with. And when they're doing videos with somebody that don't get along with somebody else that they're hanging out with, it's something a brewing, y'all. It's something a brewing. Just like I was talking about with this video right here, I was talking about Gucci Man. They got to watch out for him. Um, and then, uh, you know, as you can see now, they got to watch out for... Um, NBA young boy, but NBA young boy, he don't really deal with them like that. And what I liked about NBA young boy was the fact that um, he's venturing out to other people outside of the rap industry. He's starting to venture out to people like Lil Nas X and stuff like that, whose name is really, really big out there. And he can keep his money flowing by dealing with people that's above this other rap mess that's going on. So that's what I like about him. He's always thinking about thinking ahead. Okay, and I just want you to pay attention to these faces that's in the video with, you know, with Gucci Man, y'all. Okay, Lil Dirt and this guy right here, um, Lil, Lil Baby, Quavo, all these people are is in these videos and stuff and Lil Uzi and stuff and, you know, hanging out with certain people. And then all of a sudden they're hanging out with their ops at the same time. You have to pay attention to this stuff. Because that means something big is a brewing, okay? I keep telling y'all, you know, you know, people like to the, they like to close their eyes and be like, "No, nah, it ain't this way. It's not that way." This this has been a pattern over and over and over again, right? Before somebody else gets taken out or something big happens, y'all, okay? It's a pattern, and just like I said with this picture, look at almost the same people. Lil Uzi Bird. It's almost the same exact people. You got to pay attention to this because it's important. Okay, when people's all over the place and then they all hang, and then they all, y'all, you just have, you got to pay attention. 
because it's something a brewing. Seriously, something is definitely a brewing. And you know, Rich the kid, he thinking that he doing something big, but you know, he could be putting his own self. If they can't reach the people that they want to get to, then they'll they'll just reach out and touch you. You the one next to them, and you the back. You, you the back. They feel like Rich the kid. If you're a back door, and be a young boy, and he been taken up for you, then you a back door now. And this is how this goes. This is how this you know this mess. This is how people feel. They always looking for the next person to um to backdoor. And then they notice how you moving around with certain people that, you know, you that's loyal to you. Okay? It's just like if you got a family member that's really close, you think that she'll be real real close to you, somebody that's blood blood to you, and they backdoor somebody that's their blood blood, okay, y'all? Then when you backdoor somebody that you should have their back because they have yours. But you're out hanging out with other people and, you know, you with the in crowd, other people that don't like the person that you should be blood, blood with. Those people look at you a type of way. Like if you backdoor your own brother or your sister or your this and that and come and talk about them to them, they looking at you a type of way when you're not around. See, this is how that, that shit goes. And people don't understand that. And this is why I tell you, you have to keep your circle small and you have to be able to really trust the circle that is around you. Because if you if you cannot trust that circle and you can't like 100% say, no, I know this person got my back, then that person should not be in your circle. Okay, y'all? But I just wanted to just um, point that out. Okay? Now, is there going to be a little, I do believe that NBA young boy is going to probably distance himself from Rich the Kid now because he cannot trust this guy. I don't think there's going to be no hanging out like that. And if it is, he's going to be watching them hard, okay? But I don't think it, he just don't seem like the type that got time for that because too many people getting set up. Okay, y'all? Anyway, y'all, I just wanted to point this out. Anyway, please like, share, and subscribe if you like this video. And thanks for watching, y'all. Peace.